Hola YouTubers, I am Zenju2011 and this is a letter from Job Center. And it is, right? Me heading back into steps to work. Again. Yay. Lambo. Yeah, so basically. In about a month's time, I'll be back into steps to work. So let you get choose it depending on how many weeks you're doing. Now, I don't my experience a few months ago in my previous vlog. I was happy that I finished my. Yeah, see, this is what happens when you try to look so hard for the past six months to look for a job, and it ends up there's nothing there still. In six months, later, you're back into steps to work. It sucks, I know. I have experienced this kind of shenanigan. It's not that pleasant. It is not that pleasant. <clears throat> but my mom, who has a friend who does careers office, knows there's another way to do to get into employment with a proper wage, wage, proper money, proper pay. There we go better than steps to work. It's called Pathway, I think. So she's gonna tell my career my other careers officer about this and all that. Give it a try if it's good and all that. Now I don't know if it's gonna be like one of those you get in ASAP kind of stuff, that means you have to forget about going to other shush 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 shake not steered. <laughs> I hope it's not. I just hope it's like basically after Ericon, because that way I could be happy about it. If you know what I mean. So, that's pretty much it, I think. No, actually, no, I have officially have Pokemon Black 2. I got it last week. Yeah, that's Friday. And so far, um, no spoilers, I'm at the Dragon Gym level. So that means I'm going to get, going to bag me a Ice type. Because traditionally, uh, um, my previous Dragon experience wasn't really that good, so I kind of went in Got myself a nice somewhere in the mountains. Beat it in the end. Beat the Elite Four. It's a hard bit, but... See, the way it works is for me, when it comes to Pokemon games like this, is once you complete beating the gym leader and all this, you start to think, yep, that's pretty much it. What to do now? I know. Breeding. Because that's why I am. I don't usually complete the full game, just half of it, which is the main story plot. And yes, maybe some Pokemon ter World Tournaments and stuff, but that's pretty much it. I managed to capture the legendary Pokemon that I was supposed to capture last year, so I was pretty much happy. And even if I didn't capture, like say, one out of the two legendaries, that didn't bother me because I've already captured the other two in the previous one, so I was kind of happy. And then I started to wonder if I'm allowed to transfer the ones from Pokemon White onto Pokemon White onto Black 2. What does that mean? Do I get a duplicate? <laughs> a duplicate duplicate legendary? Oh good god. That would be f amazingly funny. That will be good as well at the same time. Watch one, Joes. Watch one, you smelly dog. Who is a smelly dog? You are. You're the smelly dog. Yeah, I took the dogs out for a walk today and it was la raining. So, I mean, look at Heidi now. Heidi, look at you. You're wet. You're scruffy and you're wet. And you smell. That goes for you too, Lulu. Look at me, Luch. 
That goes for you too, you smelly, smelly mutt. Oh, oh, look, this is the full body. Look at her. She's soaking wet. She's soaking wet. Can you believe it? <laughs> so, once again, birthday shirts. Uh, two today, if you're watching this, guys. Actually, three. Ah, oh, celebrity birthday. What does that mean? Well, basically, I said it's the same thing as birthday wish, but you were saying happy birthday to a famous certain person. Luckily for me, my friend on my friends list, I have John Swayze, who voices Lord Death, and Vulcan. No, yeah, Vulcan out of Orphan, and someone out of One Piece. Oh, and Nick Fury. So, happy birthday to Nikki, Nikki Dardis, Dardis, I don't know how you are now, but happy birthday to you. Mr. Swayze, happy birthday, you're now 48, my god, you're older than my dad. I think he is, this is 2012, his 50th is on 2018, so probably about... Six years? Six years, maybe? I know 2008 he was 40. 2009, 2010. Yeah, he's 44, so four years old, older than. You're four years older than my dad. Yay! And Shane, who is the same age as me! Happy birthday to you, man! You drunken ass god beauty man! <laughs> so. Shall we have a look at what the questions are? Ask FM. Ask. Yeah, here we go. Oh, that's ask me anything. Uh, no, that's not ask. Dot FM. Uh, as usual, log in. Log in with Facebook. What's the question of the day, Mr. Ask? Okay. Oh! This is a good question. This is actually related to this vlog, surprisingly. What would be the best job ever for you? Ooh, the best job ever for me would probably be voice acting. I love voice acting. My friends told me I do the best voices based off the character. That would be awesome to work as a voice actor. But for now, I want to focus on getting a prop, like a normal job, before achieving that, which would be um, work at a retail store. First, jo first best job would be voiceover. Second job would be a retail shop, and I mean like something to do with entertainment and stuff, because quite frankly, the stuff down here sucks. Put it this way. Um, in Belfast, we have game and HMV. Banger has none. We only have his Asda, and that's it. Like, literally, that is it. Flame at Genova. This is terrible, terrible. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm going to go in the kitchen and make myself a sandwich. Because. I won't have a woman to make me a sandwich. <laughs> I get I don't mind making sandwiches. That's fun. Anyway, uh, leave a comment over your response. Tell me what's your best job you want. You, uh, what would you, what would be the best job you ever had? Ever for you, I mean. Well, you know what I mean. So, yeah. Uh, love me, add me, subscribe me as a friend. See you soon, and I hope to see you at Oticon. Bye. Oh, and a quick update, my Dachi cosplay is done. Laters.